Hey YouTube! Oh my god, it has been a really, really, really long time! Uh, so it's been like five years since I posted a video and just where has that time gone? I don't know! Uh, so, I don't know, for a while now I've been thinking that I wanted to get back into this. Um, you know, it's something that made me really happy and that I really, really enjoyed doing. Uh, so yeah, I thought I would have a go again, um, see if you're, you know, interested in what I have to say, um, the bits that I'm really, really enjoying, you know, hearing about my life. Um, so yeah, thank you all for still um, following me, it's, um, it's really nice. Um, I hope you're all okay. Um, so God, where, where have the last five years gone? Um, so I'm now 29, uh, still living in London, um, so I'm graduated from uni, god that must have been like four or five years ago now, uh, so yeah that's when I last made a video. Um, so what, how's my life been? So I'm in a really good place now, um, not gonna lie, the last five years um, have actually been quite hard. Um, I suffered quite badly with um, anxiety and panic attacks um, and so yeah that that wasn't good I'm sure you know there's lots of other people out there who've kind of had that before um, so yeah that's been that was really tough um, so yeah kind of you know like leaving uni the kind of transition going like into kind of like adult life is really hard <laughs> really really hard um, so yeah, so it's been up and down, um, but like I said, I'm in a really good place now. I feel really kind of at ease with myself. Um, I'm really like trying to pursue the things I really, really love doing. Um, really, really getting back into my artwork. Um, I'm not sure if you all remember that I was studying illustration at uni and um, yeah, so that's kind of like my main passion. Um, but this was one of them as well, um, you know, makeup is still a massive part of my my life and my interests. Um, so yeah, it's been, you know, I've really missed um, YouTube and being able to uh, talk about products to my heart's content and, um, you know, just talking with other people about it and just how excited I still get about products um, and still kind of being away from YouTube, not having um, those kind of people to get super excited about kind of products with. Um, so yeah, I really miss that. Um, so I know that YouTube's probably changed loads since since I was making videos, but you know, there's always space for other people and little old me. So yeah, I just, um, just thought I would try again. Um, and I'd be really, really excited to hear what your views are, um, how you've all been, what you're really interested in, whether you like um, kind of the products that I really like at the moment or maybe you'd like to try them out. So anyway, enough of talking about me. Um, products that I really like at the moment. So I would say that I have really changed, really, really changed. Um, the kind of products that I used to use, I don't really use anymore. So in the past I would say couple of years now I've really really um, gone kind of down the natural route. Um, really really into kind of organic skincare, organic makeup, natural makeup. I used to wear a lot more makeup when I was younger. Um, so I've really kind of like as I've like got through my 20s I've really really toned it down. Um, I just think it, it looks nicer, it suits me better, it suits kind of me as a person. Um, so yeah, I kind of feel like I've, um, yeah, just really changed from, from where I last was with you guys. Um, so kind of products that I'm loving now, uh, products that I would, I didn't really know about or, or wouldn't have really used back then. So yeah, let me talk about what I love right now. Um, so I'd say kind of the main... Bits. So if I start with kind of my foundation tinted moisturiser, um, the ones that literally this whole summer I've been reaching for, I feel like I can't live without now. Um, but that is this. So it's the Madara, Madeira, um, Sunflower Golden Beige, it's called Tinting Fluid, 
This stuff is insane. I absolutely love it. I use it every single day. Um, I've got it on right now. So it's super, super natural. So I adore tinted moisturiser. I have forever. So I've always kind of looked through for um, kind of the best tinted moisturiser. You know, I can't even begin to imagine how much money I have spent on tinted moisturiser in my life. I think I'd be sick. Um, I still have a million, um, but still always searching for that best one. And to be honest, this is just ridiculous. It's so weird because it's really not very, um, like the coverage isn't amazing. So it's not thick. It doesn't kind of cover all my imperfections, but it just really does something to my skin. Um, and I just feel like if I go up quite close, so you can still see kind of pores, you can still see kind of all my freckles. I have just been on holiday, so my freckles are like, oh, hello. Um, uh, but yeah, it just, it just does something to my skin that I just think looks really natural, really doesn't look like I've got anything on. Um, and yeah, just really, really works for my skin type. So I've got quite sensitive skin. Um, it can get quite oily. And this just, yeah, it just really works. So if you're looking for something that's um, organic, natural ingredients, I literally couldn't recommend this stuff anymore. Um, so it's £27, which is it, quite expensive, but that's pretty much always been kind of the standard price that I've always spent on a tinted moisturiser. Um, but I've actually been quite lucky with whenever I've bought it, um, it's been half price. So I've, I think I've bought two, I, well, I bought, I've got, nearly got through one, um, onto the next one now. And yeah, both times it's been 40% off, so that's been pretty good. Um, so I initially got it from Whole Foods, love that shop, could literally live in there, I like it that much. Um, and it was 40% off, and then I just bought it off now, um, a site called Love Lulu, Love Lu Lula? Um, I'll put the link in the bottom. It's a really good kind of organic um, makeup skincare website. They're, they're amazing. All their products look really, really lovely. Um, and yeah, got it on there. Um, so yeah, I just, I adore this. So if you're looking for something quite natural, really, really, really recommend this. Um, so kind of a, quite a good swap. I have found. So there's a makeup brand called Vapor I am obsessed with. They are so good. So, so, so good. I think it's an American kind of organic um, skincare and makeup range. Um, but my favourite bronzer, bronzer that I use every single day, and oh, I still really love it, but yeah, I, I, I don't really use it anymore, is um, this Chanel. The Soleil Tan de Chanel. It's, you know, a favourite with lots of different um, people out there. It's a very popular one. Um, but for ages, I was trying to find a really good swap and I have found one. Um, so it's the Range Vapor that I've just been talking about. So it looks like this. Um, and it is called the Solar, sorry, I'm not sure if that's focusing, the Solar Translucent Bronzer Simmer, um, number 222. So it's basically just a bronzing stick. Looks like this. Let me show you on my hand what kind of colour it comes out like. So yeah, it's it's just perfect bronzer for my skin tone. And it's got a real kind of like sheen to it. So I don't look shiny, it's not glittery or shimmery, it's just sheeny and just as the day goes on and how kind of my makeup settles into my skin, it just gives this really nice kind of glowy look. And, um, you know, as getting a little bit older, I want to look as glowy as I can. So, yeah, I just, um, I don't know how well you can see it on here, but it's just, it's amazing. So if you're looking for something to, if you're going to kind of like that, that natural organic route, totally recommend that. Um, so yeah, what else have I really been liking? So natural deodorant, that has been a killer, trying to find one that, you know, to be really brutally honest, you don't, you don't smell. So I spent loads on natural deodorants and I smelt 
all the time. And I was like, how can I, can I not find one? Oh, it's really, really frustrating. Um, cause like, you know, natural deodorants, they're not super cheap, probably like kind of between five, 10 pounds. Um, but I wasted a lot of money and I just always felt like I smell and I'm not a smelly person. So yeah, that wasn't too good. But then I found this. And oh my god, it is so good. So it's the Aurelia Botanical Cream Deodorant. And it is amazing. If you're looking for a natural deodorant and you haven't found one and you're about to give up and go back to a normal deodorant, please get this because it is insane. I just, I don't smell. I can go to the gym, I can go running the whole day and I still smell fresh and that in a natural deodorant is is really hard to find just being really honest um I'm on my second one it's um it looks like this it's kind of like a white paste it smells so good it's like pepperminty fresh it's yeah it's just it's really really lovely um so I don't know if it's going to tell me so it's a natural aluminium free cream to powder deodorant um, and let me see it's got like lots of essential oils in and it's just so nice so literally couldn't recommend this product enough so yeah try that if you want to go to the natural side um, I've got lots more other things that I'm I'm really enjoying at the moment but I feel like I've been talking for quite a while now um, so probably the last thing I'm going to talk about is um, is this. So natural body moisturizer. So again, um, I moisturize literally like every day. Every day after I shower, I moisturize. And I always used to use kind of like Palmer's or kind of just any old moisturizer. And then I got kind of quite into like organic stuff um, and this I would say is like the best one that I found it's not like that expensive I think it's maybe like five six pounds it lasts for ages smells really good so again if you want to like do kind of a clean swap to kind of organic um, skincare I'd highly recommend Jason's aloe vera hand and body lotion it's super good um, so yeah, it's been really, really fun um, doing this and I'd really love to hear kind of your feedback. Um, I look a bit different now, my hair's a lot lighter. Um, so yeah, I, ho I hope you've all had um, kind of a great day and hopefully see you guys soon. If you want me to kind of talk about anything in particular, please leave me a comment. Thanks, bye!